Today I'm making a very easy and quick meal. It's spaghetti with tuna. My mom used to make that back home while she still does it. Um, I'm gonna make it. It's a little bit different because the ingredients, of course, here I cannot find the Portuguese ingredients, but here it is. I start with olive oil and some minced garlic. Um, garlic is a taste I like to use a lot. Some bay leaves. Try not to burn the garlic, we all know how it tastes. Terrible. <laughs> Add your peppers and onions. Um, I usually like to use fresh ones, but I didn't have to use frozen peppers and onions. The onion is fresh, just the peppers. Salt pepper a little bit. After it's, you know, a little bit soft. Don't need to be too, too soft, just a little. Add a can of tomatoes. Uh, I use diced tomatoes, a small can. I also add some fish bouillon. You can use seafood fish or you can scape this and just use salt. I like the taste. I also added half a glass of white wine. Just to make sure that for that. Some pepper to taste, black fresh pepper, and paprika. You can use whatever you like the best, you know, that's how I do it. Boil the spaghetti according to the package. Add your tuna, I add three cans in oil, of course it's not like the Portuguese one, but this one is pretty good. After the spaghetti is cooked, just drain your spaghetti and add to your dish. Mix it around a little bit and you can right now taste it, see if it needs more salt or... I put a little bit of hot pepper. We grow our own ghost pepper, so this one was just a little bit because it's very spicy. Some parsley, chives. You can use whatever the fresh herbs that you like. Sprinkle with a little bit more of olive oil if you desire, and here it is. Quick and easy and very delicious. Hope you enjoy. I love to decorate my plate with flowers.